Hi, I'm Alexander Sobelsma. I'm an IHS senior and I'm currently enrolled in Arc and Flame, a welding university in Spencerport, New York. And I'll be learning how to weld all processes and I'll come out certified in all of them. My normal day at welding school would be normally starting off with a lecture and then all of the rest of the class is hands-on practice and time just to perfect your craft. So I leave high school after fifth period, so that's at 12 o'clock, and I drive myself over there and I start class from one o'clock in the afternoon to 5.30. Uh, I discovered Arc and Flame last year, my junior, so my junior year in high school, um, and it just kind of seemed like a no-brainer because I like doing stuff with my hands and it seemed like a very a unique opportunity that was much more affordable than college and just made more sense for me. I've been in the program for 20 weeks so far about and it'll end in July. I started in February this year. Uh, so I actually have a job offer already lined up and I'll be going in for an interview touring a plant in Batavia where they'll pay me to go back to school and pay me while I'm in school to weld. I think this program is a kind of a no-brainer for people who like doing stuff with their hands and who aren't crazy about college. Um, it's okay to not know what you're going to do after high school and I think that options like Arc and Flame and a trade school are great options for people like me. Hi, I'm Jessica Pizzo. I'm a senior at Western Wanakoi. I'm from I go to BOCES in the morning. I do automotive. I got into this program because I've been wanting it. I've been wanting to do it when I was little. I work with my dad um, on the side, the auto service program here. Uh, freshman year and then sophomore year I did modern technology and then um, my junior year I did advanced. I've been learning basic maintenance like wheel bearings, alignment, transmissions, oil changes, electrical, AC, um, ABS. I'm going to MCC for automotive. Um, I went out on the internship and I feel like I am going in the right direction for sure. Um, my goal is to own my own shop and maybe possibly be a master tech. <laughs> Hi, I'm Tejan Tejada and I enlisted in the Army National Guard. Um, so military for me really wasn't an option um, until up until about last October. Um, I was at a work event and I had met um, my recruiter and um, he kind of gave me options that I didn't know were available in the military. And he also explained to me what National Guard was. It wasn't full-time Army, so I wasn't giving up years of my life, but I, um, I could still be in the military and still receive all the benefits from being in the service, but I could still have a regular life, regular civilian life, um, and I wouldn't have to like give up the goals that, and things I already had set. Um, so for my career, it's, um, it's IT. Um, it's technology-based, it's information technology specialist. So it's gonna be fixing computers, um, help, helping code for different things in the military. Um, I, I keep saying I'm not doing a combat job. That's not my. That's not my thing. But um, there are students here that are doing going into that, um, and I, I think it's it's really a noble, noble thing. Um, yeah. So after um, boot camp and after my um, AIT, um, I'm going to be enrolling into college for business, um, business and video, um, and then wherever education takes me after that. Um, for Army National Guard for New York State, um, I get free SUNY schools just for three years. So that's what I'm doing personally. Um, but yeah, Army, they, and they actually do strive for people to go to college. Um, if you do college before, they'll sometimes they help you pay for some of those loans and you actually come into the military at a higher rank. So even if you don't know what you're gonna do, this gives you an opportunity to learn a new skill, meet a whole bunch of new people like you would do in college and it just gives you free college if you want to do it afterwards. So after that time that you're in the service, maybe you find what you like.